Hello, this is Meme Analysis, and today we're going to be looking at Doge, and how he has changed through the years. The important characteristic to recognize is that Doge has acted as a transitional meme between three types of memes. Relatable memes, surreal memes, and ironic memes. He has been a middle ground and led to these changes. The very first memes were usually pictures of animals in very funny situations, odd situations, and then one of the major growths, one of the major evolutions, is that text and fonts, specifically impact font, began to be a presence in these memes. The dialogue of the characters, these animals began to say things. Consider the eternal and very classic I can has cheeseburger. That's an ancient meme. These memes fall into the relatable category. That's because everybody knows what it's like to have pets. Everybody, you know, can find humor in an animal in funny situations. And then the introduction of the texts, it's often, you know, very basic uh, humor. Things that a child could understand, things that a child enjoyed. Um, just to give a little personal anecdote, I remember one of my aunts had actually uh, printed out by hand lolcats and put them in a binder and would show them to other older people in the family. You know, there was this um, relatable and very funny thing about it. Everybody could laugh at it. And the, so this leads to advice animals. Advice animals for a long time were the very standard meme. It's usually a picture of an animal or a picture of a character and uh, top text and bottom text. Perhaps we'll do a video on bottom text becoming a meme later, as I will show you how that will come back into the stream, just like Doge does. So, you have the top and the bottom, and they tell a joke together. Sometimes the joke is even... Um, the, you know, the joke is on the top and the punchline's on the bottom. Very important. There was a structure, a very well-defined structure to advice animals. And then, of course, Doge happened. He, I believe, is the first bridge from classical, relatable memes into surreal memes. He is very much a piece of modernist literature in response to the classical advice animal. No longer is the font on the top and the bottom. The font is all over. Such wow, wow, so, so much, etc. You know, it's kind of the stream of conscious. There's no, there's no stratification of the, the words. In fact, you know, you don't even need to read it in an order. It's very, very deeply modernist in that sense that it is subverting classical tropes and making a more deeply expressive meme. Um, and that led to a whole lot of copycat memes where, again, the format has been freed up. No longer are we kind of bound to the advice animal format. Memes became much looser. A lot more could become a meme. And so for a while, Doge was, you know, just that Doge, just that image. But then he comes again, his second coming, and it is to bridge surreal memes, which became extraordinarily popular for a while, and into ironic memes. Memes that are now meta, making fun of older memes, making fun of old meme formats, laughing at the whole situation, and oftentimes a much more mean, a mean meta. And how is it that Doge comes back? It is in the guise of an advice animal. Top text and bottom text in impact font. So already we are given the old form, the old structure. And what happens in it? Horrible, disturbing situations. We talked about this in our first video about the queen and how Doge is kind of transcending time in the memes, that he is 
um, a soldier in Vietnam or the queen that was going to die and so on. He is in these horrible situations. No longer is the advice animal kind of a, a joking, trivial, uh, uh, a sensible chuckle. Now these memes are kind of horrible, disturbing, torturous memes. Doge is kind of actively being tortured. That is the, the real signifier of neo-Doge memes. That ironic memes have no respect for advice animals, no respect for surreal memes. Doge is now a toy to be tortured. Ultimately, this is the postmodern meme. The meme that not only transcends classical tropes, but also transcends the modernist tropes of surreal memes. It's important to look at the way that memes change. And Doge, beyond synchronistic, traveling through the past and the future in his own memes, he has acted throughout time in reality as well, by acting as a bridge. A bridge between aeons of memes. Remember, memes matter.